Hello everybody and welcome to my August 2021 booktube haul. Dane reads. It's actually the 12th of August and this is my first book. I do have another one on the way and I will have some more coming soon but um, yeah I'm doing quite well this month. My, my uh, to be read list. I got down to 30 and then this bad boy came so I'm back onto 31 and as I say I have an asterisk book on its way as well. But this is Corrings by Stephen Colgan. This is the third book in his uh, South Herowardshire series. It's like black comedy set in a little English village basically. Uh, I'll read you the blurb because why not. He's a local author. He used to be QI Elf. Um, I'm actually on the praise page. Praise for a murder to die for and the diabolical club. And it's like Stephen Fry, Sandy Toxvig, and then at the bottom, social bookshelves. Anyway, Berkeley Corring wants to live the hedonistic life of a millionaire playboy, but his sister, Marshallin, is only interested in preserving the family name and refuses to sell off any of their large jointly owned estate. Berkeley embarks upon a drastic course of action to force her to sell, which will involve the owner of a cash-strapped geriatric circus, an alcoholic clown, an incontinent elephant, and a sex toy with a mind of its own. Stephen Colgan's third and funniest South Herodshire novel continues the series that began with a murder to die for and the Diabolical Club. So yes, looking forward to this one. I've actually already started it. Salut tout le monde, j'ai reçu ce livre, c'est le combat des chefs par Argus et Adesso, c'est un bon dessinaire, uh, en anglais c'est un graphic novel, slash a comic, uh, you've probably heard of Asterix, uh, il est très connu, uh, très célèbre, uh, donc c'est le huitième livre de la série et uh, je l'ai aimé uh, beaucoup, c'est uh, très bien. Um, the druid, uh, eat a fix, il a perdu, il a perdu sa mémoire, uh, il a oublié tout, donc uh, les héros uh, doivent trouver un nouveau druid. <laughs> 4 out of 5, very good, I did enjoy. Uh, I was saying the druid, uh, eat a fix, he loses his memory so they have to find a new druid. Because there's a, a great, big, massive battle, the combat des chefs, the battle of the chiefs. Hello everybody, just the one book to report for you today. This was sent to me by Isabel Kenyon of Fly on the Wall Poetry Press. Uh, she sent me a short story collection called Fauna not long back, which was pretty good. And uh, now she sent me this, uh, On a Distant Ridgeline, Stories by Sam Rees. Um, I'm going to go ahead and, is there a blurb? There isn't a blurb. I guess there's like literary fiction stories, uh, published by Platypus Press. So uh, yes, very exciting. I'll let you know how I get on with this. Hello everybody, I got this book in the post today. It's quite a black fluffy book, isn't it? I don't know what to make of it really. What's, what's it about? It's about uh, dreamies, isn't it? It's all about dreamies. <laughs> yes, yes it is. Oh, pop him down, all right. The two books that I have received to show you are Asterix Chez les Bretons par Argosini et Adesso. Uh, say on bon dessinaire. You guys know the drill, I keep getting these. Uh, this is number eight or number nine in the Asterix series and I'm looking forward to it. He goes to Britain in this one, so he's coming to my ends. So this will be a bedtime book. And then I picked up Blackwater Town by Paul Waters. I believe this is like a thriller uh, based like during the Troubles in Northern Ireland because that's where uh, Paul Waters' background is. He's led one of the writer's workshops that I've done. Uh, it's published through Unbound, which is a very cool publisher as well. And uh, yeah, I went ahead and grabbed this. I'm going to be talking to Paul for my radio show soon as well. So I'll give you the blurb, why not? When Maverick Police Sergeant Jolly Mackin is banished to the sleepy 1950s Irish border village of Blackwater Town, he vows to find the killer of his brother, even if the murderer is inside the police. But a lot can happen in a week. Over seven days, Macken falls in love, uncovers dark family secrets, accidentally starts a war and is hailed a hero and branded a traitor. When Blackwater Town explodes into violence, who can he trust? No one, probably. Is betrayal the only way to survive? I'm gonna find out. Hello everybody, just the one book to hold for you today, that is Fantastic Voyage by Isaac Asimov. I basically bought this because I have Fantastic Voyage 2, a destination brain on my owned but unread TBR, so I figured I should probably read, buy and read this one first before getting to that one. Uh, this one's about half the size as well, and from what I understand it's a novella of a movie that I haven't seen, so I'll probably read this and then watch the movie. Alrighty rira everybody, so that is the end of my August 2021 book haul, it is now September, 
So as always, thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button if you've enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments if you've read any of these books and if so, what you thought of them. Hit that subscribe button for more and I will see you soon for another bookish video. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.